Okay. Hello. Hi. Welcome to our last ever video blog from Tanzania. Um, we should say before we start that uh, we know everyone's keen to see some monkeys. We've we've been getting some jick about the lack of monkeys in this blog, to be honest. So, uh, as promised, following our ramblings, we, you will see some actual monkeys. Yeah. Some real footage of actual monkeys that were wandering around outside our room the other day. So, yeah, stay tuned. Yeah, so um, <laughs> we're going to wrap up for the last two days. We had problems uploading our blog post yesterday because the generator broke and we had no electricity. And it was all candlelight, which is um, rather romantic and exciting, but um, meant that we couldn't do anything with our new <laughs> blog. A bit of a disappointment. So in the last few days, um, so when we first got here, we had a few days just in the activist uh, training centre, like meeting all the people, doing all the activism training and stuff. But the last two days have been rather different, haven't they, Kirsten? Yes, they have. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we went on a field trip yesterday to visit an action project, which, as you can imagine, is uh, quite inspirational and a bit of a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, really. We went to see a project which was helping girls to get an education and stay in education. Uh, by running these girls clubs after school so they get all the girls together and they talk about what are the obstacles to you getting an education for example parents obviously think it's not obviously parents often think it's not as important to educate girls as boys so uh, they talk about ways that they can persuade their parents that it's important that they get an education too and uh, other things of that nature which were all yeah like amazing and these girls were just they were just awesome they were incredible i mean they were like really articulate and sort of um, confident and sort of and they're really funny as well which we is just, great we, we just started time with them, with them a yeah, bit, did, didn't yeah we, we did yeah. I, I, I think we wanted to take them home really yeah they were, they were, they were fantastic they were really and great. they told us there were elephants in their actual school because it's like in the middle of safari area so they were like oh this is the big tank where we get our bath water sometimes the elephants come through here and drink it all and we were like what and we were like where are they where are they from and it was like from women's rights to elephants in a, in a flash but luckily we got back on track but um, the elephant was like a yeah. totally mundane thing yeah <laughs> they were like, oh yeah, it's really annoying, we have to chase them away. We're like, chasing elephants, we are not moving until this happens. But yeah, no, you won't. Yeah, we're going to have some more information about uh, that visit on the blog mm -hmm. next week, so look out for that. Mm -hmm. But yeah, last night we had to say goodbye to everyone, didn't we? Oh, it was really sad. But it was an amazing evening because we um, kind of got to sit down and chat, sort of small talk, kind of normal talk instead of <laughs> activism and campaigning. <laughs> it was kind of like, hey, um, I come from this place and this is what it's like and this is what we get up to which is uh, really nice wasn't it? We've had these incredible lives and they've mm. grown up just to be just amazing inspirational people I keep banding that word about but like genuinely really quite special. No definitely yeah. and, I, and I think like you know hearing their, their activist stories are just uh, in yeah, really inspiring again. It's inspiring, fantastic, amazing. <laughs> they really was, and they really are incredible. Um, so yeah, yeah, if you wanna, yeah, if you wanna be part of the network, right, go to uh, myactivista.org and uh, hook yourself yeah. up. But, yeah. yeah, we're gonna have a little buzzer so that every time we say inspirational. Yeah, cut us off. One of us gets to hit the other one or something. But you said it. <laughs> And the last thing I want to say is that one of the activists who was on the training here, uh, a really uh, interesting girl called, not inspirational, interesting girl called uh, Kodili, and she's an activist from the Uganda who has um, a, a fantastic story about kind of discovering activism and how her involvement with Action Aid has changed things in her own life. And uh, she's going to be guest blogging on the site next week. So keep your eyes peeled for that, folks. Should we quickly wrap up on what we did today? Even though it's not activism related. Oh, just tell them, just tell them the story. Just All tell right, them then, the snake story. The story. <laughs> this is our day off. Kirsten and I had a day off today, um, and we went with the activista coordinators, um, Annette and Casper. Hi, guys. Um, <laughs> to uh, do a sort of like mini kind of trek around the um, local national park, which is um, Mount Meru. Yeah. And uh, and it was amazing. It was incredible. Really, really hot. The landscape was beautiful. The animals were amazing. But to wrap up quickly, quickly every we day. did, we yeah. did, um, I saved the next life, that's why people, <laughs> I did. Because we were walking so through true. and there was a snake, true. and um, so I took the snake and I hit it over the head of the stone, <laughs> I tied it in a knot and I threw it away and said, don't worry Annette, I'm here for you. Or I did a little girly scream and ran off, you can choose which version yeah, of the story amazing. you think is true. Because we've been walking for about three hours and we'd all gone a bit quiet because we are all a bit tired and stuff and suddenly yeah. from the yeah. back we just hear this like almighty like snake! <laughs> and he comes thundering past, followed by Annette and I'm like, ooh, is it 
missing the tree. <laughs> it's like totally missing the urgency yeah. of the moment. And then it turns out that it was like a green mamba. So, uh, Which is like really poisonous. Really, really, really dangerous. So, uh, yeah, that's yeah. fun. Thanks very much. And Annette was about to step on it. And, yeah. She was, she was, but I, um, I stepped in in time, so it was alright. <laughs> So you're, you're lucky to have With us my, today. Yeah, yeah, you're lucky, <laughs> lucky to have us. But yeah, um, so we're going to head off for our final night now. Um, yeah. We're going to sadly sign off from Tanzania and um, we hope that you've enjoyed these video vlogs. We've certainly enjoyed making them. We have. It's, and, been, um, it's been emotional. Yeah, it really has. It really has. <laughs> I know. But stay tuned for the monkey mashup. All right, here come the monkeys. Bye. Okay, so Kirsten and I finally sighted some monkeys. Okay. And there he is. Oh my god, I love it. Which is really exciting and it's our first um, sort of sighting of wildlife as it were. Because so far we've just kind of heard some birds. <laughs> yeah, you looked at me. Hey! Oh, bye! Monkey, 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 monkey.